Okay guys, so what do we do on this channel? Well, I'm mainly known online as a model kit builder and diorama builder, but I'm mainly known for what's called figure kit building. So if you've never heard that term before, basically back in the day, there was four ways to build a model of a figure. So the first one was to sculpt it yourself, which was the hardest one to do. Uh, then if you, bought, if you bought it in a kit form, you had one of three options. The first one was styrene, or styrene kits, which is plastic kits to most people. And after that you've got vinyl kits, which tend to mainly always be orchestrated on the figure kit building uh, circuit. And then if you put an extra uh, couple of uh, coins into the hobby, you could buy yourself a nice crisp resin kit and the resin kits are mainly the ones that everybody aimed to build because they were more durable and they lasted a lot longer. So if, you, uh, if you've heard this term and you're interested in seeing uh, these figures being built then this is definitely the channel for you. So those were the main ways in the old times, oh gosh I'm so old saying that, I can't believe I said that. <laughs> in the uh, yeah originally those were the main four ways to do it if you weren't a sculptor you only read three options really but with modern day technology new ventures have opened up mainly in the form of uh, 3d modeling building or 3d uh, printing so at the moment as far as I know there's only two variants of this so there's the filament which is usually uh, PLA which is like a tough plastic that melts and then it can be shaped and then once cool it rehardens again to make a, full, a solid uh, 3D shape. So the other option apart from that is resin. Now more, quite a lot of people are a bit hesitant about dipping their toe into the world of resin printing and I myself I did take a while to get in there, a couple of people tried to talk me into it sooner rather than later and I always kept putting it off via because of cost or are you hearing horror stories about toxic fumes or cleaning it with uh, certain solutions but uh, I have to admit since buying my first resin uh, printer which was uh, the Elegoo Mars I have to admit I have fallen in love with uh, resin printing Quick video from the future, not so far in the future that can give you good financial advice, just a couple of days from when I re originally created that first video. And the reason why I've had to create this and send it to the past is basically I forgot to mention a few things. Basically in a nutshell, I'm, uh, every YouTuber out there has a Patreon page, or at least it seems that way and I'm a bit late to the party. So I've gone over and I've created one and I've created three tiers. So first one is just a pound a month. That's just for anybody that is just a general supporter of the channel. Then we have three pound a month, which is for more for the intermediate fans. And then we have five pound a month for the hardcore fans that uh, really want to see this channel grow. So there's all kinds of different perks and all that on the page. So please go over there and check it out if you have five minutes to spare. If you don't want to sign up to Patreon, that's totally fine. You can still help out the channel just by clicking that like button, commenting on the videos or sharing on social medias. Or if you just want to reach out and buy me a coffee, that would be really appreciated. There will be links in all the comment sections of all the videos. And if you can't find one there, then on the home page, it'll be a little icon in the top right hand corner saying tip jar. And that basically just takes you to my, a link to my uh, PayPal account where you can just send me a couple of, uh, couple of dollars or a couple of pound. And that would just help out in the long run. So back to the original video. So, so if you are interested in unique dioramas, unique models, unique props, 
or just basically 3D printing in general, then please don't be afraid to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on future builds. So once again, I'm Francis Gray and thank you for joining us. I'll see you in some builds.